this is a nice little area. I don't know if this looks dark or not. Let me pull my hat back. Somebody said in my last video they couldn't see my face. Every time I turn on the first 48, I see Dallas. You know, I, mean? I don't know what's going on up here. So what you talking about? Pops! I need him to send me that tie out. <laughs> what? I gotta hurry up and get my permit because... What's a tie out, bud? A tie out. Is that... The okay. thing. All right. The thing. Y'all like my little short, dude? The video probably already up. You like it, babe? It's nice. It's you nice. like my hat? <laughs> I like my hat. <laughs> Y'all like that? <laughs> okay, let me I show like my, my face. Hat. She's the only one I know buy something for somebody to borrow. Did you buy it for me or did you buy it for yourself? Okay, what you forget is... I see is, through you. You are forgetting. I see through you. Did you buy it for me or did you buy are it for yourself? Are we one or not? I see through you. So this hat is mine. This top is mine. Those pants are mine. All of this over here. So did you pick out the hat for yourself or for me? I picked it out for you. Well, I was going... Okay, so here's the thing. All right. I picked it out for Gerard, but Gerard is... um well endowed up here <laughs> so i was thinking you know it's really not going to be a lose if he can't fit it because then i'll have a nice hat god is my source oh so my um god. what i'm going to do is now that i see that he's kind of being a little stingy with the hat he doesn't want to share i'm going to get myself one so then we'll both have one and then we'll be no, we can share we can share we can share <laughs> we'll, we'll go ahead he didn't want to share y'all yeah. but hey guys Hey said, guys. You know why I said that like Martha? She says it like that. Oh it's like so God. phony. It's like girl. Hey guys, so we are moving to oh, we should say we have an announcement. Let's kinda like be extra. <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> hey guys! <laughs> so we have an announcement. We have a huge announcement. And it's no, it's not we're having a baby. No. <laughs> don't ask that in the comment section. That's a no, no, no. A big announcement. <laughs> okay, it's not really that big, but we're moving to Dallas. <laughs> If you guys have been following my story for a while, you all know when I shared, I had a video about my faith journey. And in that video, I shared that when I began my journey from North Carolina to Texas, my first stop was Dallas. I felt compelled to see what Dallas was like first. I thought I was gonna move to Dallas, but God ended up navigating me to Houston. And it's funny how God reroutes you back to where you originally started. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I was in Houston for a little bit. This is like my fourth. I've been in Houston for almost four years. And now we're moving to, to Dallas. Dallas. Yeah, Gerard got a job here. So I'm excited about the move. T-Town. No, I'm pumped about it as well. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of bittersweet, you know. I was just starting to embrace being a Houstonian and being from Houston and repping the Rockets and repping the Texans. Hard. And uh, yeah, man, we in D town now, so yeah. I, I guess I'll embrace the Cowboys and the Dallas Mavericks and TD I Jakes love the and everything that yeah. Dallas has to offer. But uh, yeah, we're excited, especially for me, because I feel like this is gonna be something that we're doing together. Like him moving from Cleveland to Jersey, that was like a move he did individually, like by himself. Me moving from North Carolina to Houston, that was kind of an individual move. But Dallas, this is something that we're doing together. So right. it feels good that this is, you know, yeah. married life, new thing. We're doing it together. We're going to have our first place that we're actually picking out together. Yeah. We're going to be designing and everything together. Yeah, but mostly me. <laughs> mostly me. I'm excited about that. Yeah, and I'm hoping yeah. to record some videos and stuff during the process. I'm really... And I don't know how this is going to work out, but I want everything like new in our place because so much of what we have now in our current place in Houston, it's like my stuff. And I just want like it to be our stuff, like stuff that we get together. So this place is going to look phenomenal and it's going to have the Bennett stamp on it. <laughs> so that's going to be fun. It's going to have Mary B stamps on it. <laughs> For uh, sure. <laughs> he a little old school, y'all. We'll see. I don't know. So we have five places on our list, and um, we're going to have fun deciding which place we're going to go with, because by the end of this week, we need to know where we're going to stay and have that secured. Absolutely. So. Um, 
so and we really don't even honestly we don't know what this is gonna look like because getting out of our lease y'all these leasing That's offices lease. try to rape you when it comes no, to breaking no, no. your lease it's a contract and i understand it is it's a contract so you agreed to stay for X amount of time. What I was hoping for, given that Mary has been an outstanding resident, was just a little flexibility in terms of working with us, uh, with getting out of the lease, whether it be, you know, allowing us to showcase the apartment while we're still in it or, you know, different things like that. But uh, we'll see what happens. I think it'll all work out. I think I'm going to have to do a little pushing. A Bubba to kind of get it out there that hey, you know, we can possibly let someone else sublet department or if they want to take it over because they did offer us that, yeah, so that's an option, and then uh, or just getting out of it so they we, can we can't sublet it, babe. She said not subletting, but we can actually bring them there and they would basically yeah. move into the apartment, basically taking over the lease or starting a yeah. new lease with the apartment, or uh, you know, I'm gonna have to probably do some pushing of getting her out of the apartment so it can actually be empty so they can then begin to show it because i think it's kind of strange that they want us completely out of the apartment before they would actually allow others to view it i've mm -hmm. viewed apartments myself in the past where people were actually still there and they're getting ready to transition out so they and that was just a little it. bit more cooperation but you know um they decided to not allow us to do that they want the apartment to be completely empty uh, before they actually move someone else in or even or list let, it. let 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 list it or even let someone view the apartment. I, I kind of understand that Gerard he's like no they should let us no. deal because they the option is we would have to vacate and our, still pay rent consistently still pay rent vacate give them the keys and, and give them the keys that's strange <laughs> to me because what hypothetically what if we want to go to houston for the weekend and just say you know we still paying rent here uh, let's let's stay in the house we paying rent you know what i mean it ain't like yeah. we're getting something for free so it's like you know and who's to say you know uh i doubt someone will be living there while we're paying rent like basically you know but I want that ability, you know. What I mean, we're but they're still able to rent. expedite the process so much more if we're not in the in the apartment. So if they list it and then somebody says, you know, I want that apartment tomorrow, they don't have to worry about us now having to take all this extra time to get everything out and having to coordinate that. I get it from a business standpoint, but neat it for us. I'm just in a place where it's like we're just gonna do whatever we got. We we have to do at this point just to mm -hmm. make this whole transition happen. And so if that means right now me staying in Houston for X amount of time, my lease isn't up until August. So if I have to, you know, come to Dallas and visit Gerard for like two weeks or so, and then I'm in Houston for two weeks or a week, whatever the case may be, like, we're just going to make it work. So we'll see what happens, but I'm excited about Dallas. Uh, it's going to be cool. I think it'll be straight. Yeah. I know. Uh, so. We've done the long distance thing before, but... It's not yeah. really as long as it was before because I can actually like get in a car and get to uh, you. Just four hours in. Yeah, I and mean, you can do the same. For you can Whitney. stay here 90% of the time. You can I stay could here actually, the whole time. yeah, I could stay the whole time. But that's pointless to be paying yeah. rent in two different places. Yeah. So. But that's just, we, we're not paying $11,000 to break no lease. <laughs> so <laughs> so that's just what, yeah. it's, what it is right now. But but no, that's, that's where you guys come involved. So listen. What? Houston. It's a great place to live. He's going to try to encourage somebody. Yo, you want to take over our I'm telling you, it's nice. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Very, very nice. Sweet home gym. Uh, great management people. Babe, they're, they're you should awesome. be a salesman. They're very good. You know, although they, you know, they have their policies and procedures they have to follow. They're phenomenal. I love it. But they've been but great. Uh, y'all, we not trying to sell y'all on our apartment. Grill. <laughs> Game room, babe. We not selling them the, on the what's, what's that area? The low, the low area where we kind of did the uh, little date that one time. What do they call that area? Man, why am I blanking on what that's called? But nevertheless, it's dope. Yeah, it you know is very I mean? really nice. I can't think of what good it is. Good energy, right now. good community. We haven't had any issues with any of our neighbors. No, everybody's been solid. Uh, so listen, man. Slide in my DM. Man. Slide in my DM. Slide. You like them DMs, don't you? Hit your boy you? on the DM. You like them DMs. Hit your boy on the DM. <laughs> and if you don't know our story, <laughs> then you need to go look at the previous videos and, so you can uh, figure out why we said we that. We can arrange this apartment situation. Because I need my wife here in Dallas full time. She can't be doing me no part time. <laughs> Baby, it's her. only until August. I need her full time. It's so. only until August. No, that's too long. I mean, a day is too long. 
you trying to spit game right now. I'm saucing it right now. Let <laughs> me get your lips. <laughs> you see, I don't stick. need no chapstick. I'm you good. You need chapstick. My wife always want to put chapstick on. I don't need it's no It's like chap. I can feel when your lips are. I'm l oh, looking I'm at you. Great. It's me. I'm good. Ain't no looking at me. You need some chapstick. <laughs> I don't need all that. Mom, put some on. I'm great. Look. Well, kiss me, kiss me then. I got that God given. I got that God given. I'm good. I'm good. Mm. Come on, you need chapstick. Hit my DM. I'm from Dallas, but I deep town boogie. Oh my God. This is our first place, guys. Let's see what it has to offer. I don't know how old she was, but I know she's older than us, right? Uh -huh. and, and we, the woman who came to get the dog. Uh, this boy gonna say, how's the sound in the apartment? We saw that our neighbors were on the older side and we don't want them concerned because we making all that noise. Really? Really? What'd she say to girl? 
talking about some Diego. How's the sound in the place? Because we're a newlywed couple. I was just being honest with the man. He's a jerk. Trying to tell him what's going on. Ain't nobody doing nothing. But the thing is, you know what? I don't know if you felt that. I was cool. She she didn't come over nice. She didn't. And friendly. She was like, she, yeah. I think so it's just that. Oh, absolutely. So here's the thing. Uh, yeah, she with was the black so nice. lady. Like, uh -uh, her energy was so different. I'm touching her dog, and she probably like. She like. She, she sorry, she but she like get off my dog. Yeah, yeah. What you doing? Get yeah, your hands off. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Like on some mean and nasty stuff, and I felt her energy. Yeah, I was and like, I'm like, I don't know about we, these neighbors. We're gonna have a problem with her. Uh, you know? super excited we're not going to tell you all the actual name but we will give you all an apartment tour and everything because we don't want you guys to be stopping by um unannounced or anything but yeah. you can stop by and see me yeah. yeah why are they seeing you they i don't know i'm taking clients man taking clients <laughs> <laughs> but i hope that you all enjoyed this video we're super excited we're moving to dallas and it's so weird because across the street it's literally addison this Dallas Ad Addison, we've been all over y'all looking for places, but we're happy we finally found the place and we're going to start our new journey in Dallas. <laughs> so we love you guys. Be sure to comment, like, subscribe, and we'll see you all in our next one. Thanks guys. Bye.